Hi everyone, it's Tiffany and I am here with Mr. Cons. I want to thank the company for sending this action figure to me. Um, I've been seeing Mr. Cons all over, all over the stores and I've been really interested in seeing what they're about and I'm really excited to have had the opportunity. So this box just kind of contains a few goodies. Um, I already took the stuff out so we have some cards, we have a pack of cards, we just have temporary tattoos and some information sheets. But we have the one of the actual action figures here that we're going to be taking out and taking a closer look at for sure. But I did want to show you this box. This box is so cool. It's a book. A box that's shaped like a book. I think that's so neat. So let me just kind of set that off to the side. Actually, I'll just take it out of there. And then we will take a closer look at this, this Mysticons package. So we have... Who do we have? What's, which one is this? I guess I should look on the front. Piper, Piper, it says Piper. So it says, seize your destiny, save the realm. An epic tale of four girls who are chosen to be legendary warriors known as the Mysticons. They band together to protect their realm from evil. Also collect, oh goodness, I'm sorry for pronouncing these wrong. I'm kind of glad I got Piper because that's easier to say. <laughs> we got uh, Ar uh, Arcana, Arcane, Arcana, uh, Zaria, M, and Tasma. Ooh, she looks pretty awesome. I've never seen her in stores. I always see these two for sure, but I've never seen her. Anyway, Piper is the Mysticon Striker. Piper Willowbrook, Mysticon Striker, is a 10 year old elf in con constant motion. As a parkour master, she pings off walls with a flurry of ninja batic skills and flings her energy hoops during battle. Piper fills her room with plushies and always keeps one by her side. Oh, that's so cute! So there's an app, Mysticon Secrets of uh, Gemina. Again, sorry if I'm mispronouncing all this stuff. But this looks, these look so cool. I'm really, really loving these so far. And it says, as seen on Nickelodeon, because it is a show. And it includes Topps Trading Cards. Oh, okay, that's cool. So we got a Topps Trading Card. Where did that pack go? We do have an actual pack here as well. So super stoked to get that open. We're going to go ahead and get this out of the box. Can I just say how much I love the packaging as well? Get this out of the box, and then we'll take a closer look at it and check out the cards that we got. Before we start taking a look at the action figure, I do have this sheet of information I just wanted to share with you guys. Apparently... This show isn't out yet. I totally mis misunderstood that. It totally is premiering this summer on Nickelodeon in the US and the fall on YTV and in Canada. So I was under the impression it was already out because the toys were already out. But in this case, the toys come out and then the show. <laughs> so it says, the new hero brand that showcases every girl's strength, confidence, and character. Introducing Mysticons, a new genre-defining series about four girls from different walks of life who are transformed into legendary warriors. After discovering a powerful mystical tomb, tomb, tomb? the fearless force of those girls are drawn together by a prophecy to battle evil and protect the realm. Watch as these unexpected heroes transform into oath-bonded warriors and undertake a mythic quest to save the world. An action series rich in story and mythology, Mysticon's epic and original plot about urban fantasy can be described as Manhattan meets Middle Earth. With real relationships, distinct personalities, and already strong, confident, smart, witty, and funny characters, Mysticon focuses on the representation of girl strength, power, courage on the television show. So that's something to look out for. This actually sounds really cool. And <laughs> I was thinking as I was opening this action figure, I'm like, I gotta check this TV show out. So I'm definitely going to be tuning in. I need to check that out. Um, it does also, on the other side, has like little bios of each character. I'll actually let you guys, you know, pause the video if you want and you can read. But let's go ahead and take a look at Piper. Oh my goodness, hi girl. It took us like a really long time in the video to get to you, but this, this is really awesome. Okay, so lots going on. Let's read about her just so we know. I think I think this basically says the same stuff that the back of the box said, but we'll just make sure. Um, Piper is also known by her Mysticon's alter ego, Mysticon Striker. Piper is an elf who grew up on the street with her friend Zyra. Okay, so she's best friends with Zyra. Um, or Zariah, Zariah, sorry. She loves music and acrobats and is a natural performer. With her optimism, energy, and love of fun, Piper defends the city with her hoop staff, we hoop, hoop staff weapon. So it's this thing. It's like, hi-ya, hi-ya, hi-ya. 
<laughs> not really sure how she uses it, but it looks exciting. So she has that attached in her hand. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. You can't take it out. Now, she has so much going on. These figures are so cool. The head moves from just side to side. Well, I guess it's on a ball. It kind of moves up and down just ever so slightly. And then we have this bit of gear here. This cannot come off, uh, I guess, from the looks of it. It's obviously you can move it about and it's uh, very rubbery and cool. Now we have her, of course, painted on bodysuit, her uniform. Uh, her shoes are also painted on. They have like these awesome little flames coming off of them. And then she has this little, I guess, it, is it a snake? It kind of looks like a snake. No, I think it's a flame. I was like, is it a snake? I don't know what it is, but it kind of just loops around her arm, which is really cool. And it's translucent. Actually, is it a, is it a bird? It's something. Is it like a phoenix? Is it a phoenix? <laughs> it might be. Because she, she, everybody has a different... I don't know, maybe they all have, maybe that's just a Mr. Kong logo thing. I don't know. I really don't know what what creature that is they have on their on their arm. But they all have one. It kind of looks like a dragon on some of them. Kind of looks like a unicorn on M's. But anyway. Her legs move, of course. Well, her knees bend, and they kind of bend that way too. Don't do that. <laughs> But her legs can move everywhere, um, just right at the hip and at the knee. And then the arms move at the shoulder and at the elbow. And the wrists even move, which is so awesome. And both wrists move, yeah, just making sure there. That is pretty much it for movement-wise. Can, they can't really twist at the waist or anything. Um, this bit here also is kind of the same material as this, but it also cannot come off. So she's, she's stuck wearing her, her outfit. Which is cool. Oh, I forgot about this. This is also very, very rubbery. So she can hold it in either one of her hands. Um, you gotta be careful because her wrist bends so easily. So there we go. She's gonna be ready. She's like, I am so ready to fight. I'm so ready to fight all of the evil. And it's so awesome. Her legs are so, so flexible. Okay, there we go. We should take a look at the cards that came with her. Let's see, will you sit down? That's a really good question. Oh my gosh, this knee keeps bending out. It's freaking me out. Um, actually, I'm just gonna have her take a nap. Like, you know, superheroes need a nap every once in a while. So inside, oh, we also got this. I'm sorry, we also got this. I don't know what it is. Uh, it doesn't really say anywhere at all what it is. I don't know if it's her pet or whatever, it kind of does look like some kind of pet. Looks like a hippo, mole rat, um, lion type thing. <laughs> and it's translucent. And it's just a solid figure. It doesn't move, it doesn't have any holes or anything in it. So that's interesting. I don't know what this is, maybe we'll find out later. So we do have a checklist, question mark? I guess, okay. So, we have the cards that are available, we have the action figures that we're looking at today, we have these. I remember seeing one of these at Target, I was freaking out, I thought it looked so cool. And then we have ones with glowing lights. You have an actual Mysticon Warrior gear set, which is so cool. And then we have a plush. This is Choco Zyra's pet. Okay, so they do all have pets. I wonder why they didn't do all of the pets. That's that's weird. Then we get one card. We get Piper's card. I love the cards. They look so good. And then of course we have her little bio there, and you can download the app. Oh my gosh, I love the card. It just looks so pretty. And then we have our pack of cards. This is the last thing we have. The Mysticon Fun Pack, look for fun emoji stickers, coloring cards, code cards, and more. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what we have. Okay. So we have the Behold the Revenge Beast. Talk with Dad. Oh, fun. It's so cute. A new dragon disc. Auntie Yaga's Cure. Oh, look at her little pet. Oh my gosh. We got a coloring card. That's awesome. I love that. 
Oh, and they have backs. They have stuff on the back. Hold on, we'll go back through that. And then we have, is that Kitty bo Boom? Wait, Kitty. Pity hit. It's either an H or wait, what is it? Kitty Boone. Okay. <laughs> so I wasn't sure what it was. So it has her name, what she is. She's the captain of the Pink Skulls. And then they have the little bio for her. Now with these, it just tells you what's happening in the scene. That's really neat. That's cool. And then we have trivia on this one. The first Mysticon Dragon Mage was named what? I'm going to say C. C! I just picked C because I don't know. I just kind of felt like picking that. Uh, oh, and then we have a rune message. Oh, that's really cool. You can decode that. And then, of course, we have the coloring one. And that's what she's supposed to look like in case you need to know what she needs to be colored like. Or you can just completely color her something else. Let me know in the comments below what this little guy's name is if you know. I've looked. I can't find it. I only found the one girl's pet's name because it's on that checklist. But we don't know who this guy is. I didn't say on the box either. I checked. I double checked. Anyway, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe because I post new videos every single day. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.